An inquest has heard a Moonta mother suffered a fatal heart attack just hours after being declared well enough to be released from hospital. Fiona Selby Forgrave's devastated husband today broke down while recalling how their children found her unconscious on Mother's Day. Fiona Selby Forgrave had everything to live for, mum to two young boys and recently married to the man of her dreams. It's devastating for, and heartbreaking. But in the early hours of Mother's Day 2013, Fiona's life came to a sudden end. The 35-year-old suffering a fatal heart attack just hours after being sent home from Wallaroo Hospital. She was unconscious in the bathroom upstairs with our uh, eldest boy, the two-year-old, uh, yelling out, mummy, mummy as I was trying to run up the stairs. The inquest heard Fiona had earlier been rushed to hospital with severe chest pain and pain in her arms. She'd passed out and was pale and sweaty. But despite those warning signs, Dr Peter Marsh discharged her, warning her not to drive because she might have epilepsy. Mr Selby Fulgrave told the coroner his wife was still in pain and experiencing tightness in the chest when she was discharged. In fact, she was so weak she slumped over in the hospital foyer as the couple waited for their lift home. State coroner Mark Johns will determine if Fiona's death could have been prevented. Dr Marsh will give evidence tomorrow. Rhett Burney, Nine News.